What's up everybody, hope you're all doing great. Um, in the next few minutes we'll do a quick price prediction and price analysis on Anchor. Um, so yeah, I saw that it was trending a little bit, I mean relatively to all the other cryptos today with 5% up against Bitcoin and Ethereum 7%, I, th I think that says more. Uh, volume is looking great as well. Um, you know, volume used to always be lacking with Anchor, I believe, uh, but now it's actually quite decent. Oh no, here it was good as well, the 27th. Okay. Oh no, I was wrong. But yeah, volume is looking uh, steady. It's 8% of the market cap, but that's not too bad with a uh, relatively high market cap coin. Uh, so yeah, we'll do a quick technical analysis on it. First two disclaimers. First one being that this is not financial advice. It's just my opinion based on technical analysis. And um, second one being that this uh, whole analysis is based upon the assumption that we remain in relatively stable markets. Uh, so if any big fundamental event or move happens, then please forget about the analysis because, um, uh, uh, frankly, fundamentals are still stronger than technicals. Uh, so yeah, let's get right into it. As you can see, we actually uh, reached eight cents, which was a very strong uh, key level, or we almost reached it, but we reached the key level around it. Uh, found resistance there. <clears throat> Before that, a very bullish formation formed. I mean, we broke this key level right here. Um, kind of consolidated at it, but that creates quite a strong key level um, after a while. So that's great too. Um, great support level in this case. And now we're actually trying to get above that 7.6 cents area. And basically I have two things that I think can happen. First of all, if we do manage to close within or um, if we close above 7.6 uh, cents, um, then I actually think that we can take a break retest off of 7.6, 7.7 .7 cents uh, and get even higher. And uh, the next price target would be around 8.2 up until 8.5. So that's quite a big uh, area, but I do think we can reach that. Um, from there, to be honest, I do think we are going to fall down again a little to at least 7.5 cents again. Uh, but still, that would be great to reach those price levels again. So I think that's possible. But as I said, then we would really ne need to break uh, 7.635 to be very precise. So yeah, uh, what I think is the most likely scenario is that either so it, that we don't break it. I think that's the most likely scenario. Uh, and from there, I think we will probably uh, drop down again to first of all between 7.3 and 7.1. To be honest, I do think that uh, that can hold. So we might have a small consolidation between 7.6 and 7.1. Uh, but eventually within these markets, which which are still filled with, with quite some fear and stuff, I do think we are going to drop down to uh, six and a half cents again. And uh, as for now, that's my last support. I think that's going to hold. And from there we might, or we probably will go up again, maybe after a consolidation of some sorts. Um, but I do expect to move like, like something like this uh, from there again. Um, but that's a little bit more long term. So, um, yeah, that's basically my analysis on Anchor for the upcoming week, week and a half, uh, depending on what uh, scenario. So if you do have any questions about the analysis, please let me know down in the comments and I'll make sure to respond to that as soon as possible. Uh, but as for now, thank you all for watching and listening and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.